couple of weeks ago, the marshlands had trouble with a herd of buffalo. Eventually, both sides retreated, the honours even. Now the buffalo are back, with a vengeance. Although the whole pride are here to defend them, the little cubs panic and head out into the open, making them even more vulnerable. One of the bulls is onto them in a flash. The lioness's valiant attempts to distract the buffalo are to no avail. One of the little cubs becomes separated from the rest of the pride, and the buffalo try and root it out. Once all the cubs have disappeared from view, the buffalo finally lose interest and drift away. I've never seen anything like this in my life and having watched this group with these tiny cubs, it's incredibly distressing. We started with 11 cubs and to be honest, I haven't got a clue how many we're left with. The lionesses certainly don't know. They're moving around, calling, 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 desperately looking for their little cubs. But the way those buffalo were just hammering into the grass, I would be amazed if there are not some dead cubs around here. My worst fears are confirmed. One of the little cubs hasn't made it. And the mother just doesn't seem quite sure what to do. But even her little calls, it's, it's such an ambiguous situation because she's calling in the way that she would in trying to reunite herself with her cubs. And at the same time, it's now become just an item of food. And that seems almost impossible to rationalize. But by eating the cub, in some ways, she's recouping her investment in conceiving it. Very few animals seem to acknowledge or appear to acknowledge the death of one of their own. And nothing that I have seen would tell me that lions do. And as for the other little cubs, it's as if the incident hadn't happened at all. They seem as if they've completely forgotten. Unbelievably, considering what we'd witnessed, 10 of the 11 cubs survived. Those that did will hopefully be a lot wiser about buffaloes in the future.